Okay, today my video is about Israel, Christians' persecution going on in Israel. You know Israel, we love you all. We love you from many years. We have been supporting Israel in everything that happens. We love Israel from the bottom of our heart. And we love Israel because our Yeshua HaMashiach, which is your Messiah as well, he was born in Israel, in Bethlehem, from the tribe of Judah and from the line of David. So dear friends, Israel, we love you so much as Christians. And if you see, all the Christian countries have been supporting Israel every time. We have been standing in solidarity with Israel all the time but you know most we know there are so many Jewish people who are coming to know the Jewish Messiah who are coming to know Yeshua Mashiach who is not just a Messiah but who is who has fulfilled all the prophecies of the Bible and who came down literally as God in flesh Emmanuel a child will be born through a virgin and he will be called Emmanuel and that child is none other than Yeshua HaMashiach and you know lot of your Orthodox Jewish people they are not explaining you they are misguiding you by their own rabbinic uh, laws rabbinic laws and rabbinic teachings they are misguiding you from the true Messiah they are not Especially, I call for Tovia Singer. You know, Tovia Singer is always behind Christians. He always likes to go against Christianity. He likes to sing with Muslims, but he likes to go against Christians all the time. And you know, Tovia Singer, I am telling you today, you can bite Christians, but you know, your Yeshua HaMashiach will not let us get hurt because we believe in the Jewish Messiah who is the God of the heaven and the earth. Christ Tovia Singer is always against Christianity and he is going with Orthodox Jewish people against Christians and making videos about Jesus mocking God and that is not good Tovia Singer. So you think and your Jewish Messiah has given, we are the spiritual Israelites today. You are only the physical Israelites. We are the spiritual Israelites because we recognize the Messiah. We know the Messiah. We recognize and don't forget that all the Bible books were written by Jewish people. Those who believed in Messiah, they are blessed. And it says that dear friends God Yeshua HaMashiach has told us that he has given us the power over all the power of the enemy and he has given us the power to trample upon serpents and scorpions so Tovia Singer you can talk about Christians against Christianity and you can say Jesus was this Jesus was that but it is your Messiah and you people are waiting for some other Messiah you people are waiting that uh, Messiah will come and save Israel physically. My dear friends, Messiah is only for spiritual salvation. Saving you from sin, from eternal death and from Satan. So Jesus, Yeshua HaMashiach, even your, even your main, even your main rabbi, that is, uh, uh, there is a main rabbi, isn't it? Uh, the main rabbinic Mo Moshe, uh, Mosheak he also said in his uh, books that Jesus will come and suffer for the sins of the whole world and even Isaac Kaduri Isaac Kaduri when he before dying he left a note 
and he said in that note that I have revealed the Messiah, who is the Messiah, and it came out to be Yeshua HaMashiach. So dear friends, you, all the rabbis of Israel, you can misguide people, but you know God said in the Bible, in the end times I will pour out my Holy Spirit and every knee shall bow and every tongue will confess that Jesus is God. And you know, when Jesus, Yeshua HaMashiach, when he was tempted in the desert by Satan, three times Yeshua HaMashiach was tempted in the desert. And what did Jesus say? In the end, Jesus said, Do not tempt the Lord thy God. So he said, I am the Lord your God. Do not tempt me. So Jesus Christ, in Hebrew, Yeshua HaMashiach, is none other than Yahweh, the great I am. I am the great I am. Yes? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. When Moses first saw, met with God, spoke with God, he said, go and tell the Israelites, I am that I am. And Jesus is that great I am. So dear Israelites, repent. And you are still being stubborn. If you see in the Bible, God said to you, Israelites, you have disobeyed me from the beginning. God said, you are stubborn, stiff neck and whoring generation. Can you imagine God telling you like that? So dear friends, still your stubbornness and stiff neck we can see. But you know that Almighty God, Everlasting Father, He knows how to humble people. He knows how to humble people. And God will humble you. And every knee shall bow and every tongue will confess that Yeshua HaMashiach is none other but God in flesh who came down only for the plan of salvation for the sins of the whole world. And Christianity, you say the, the Christians are coming in Israel and forcing people to convert. My dear Tovia Singer, we are not forcing anybody to convert. Christianity is not a religion. Christianity is a relationship with God. And we don't force. It's it's up to you to believe. We in Ezekiel 20, in, in Ezekiel 3, it says, we are like watchmen and we are like stewards. We are like watchmen and like stewards. God says, go and preach the gospel. Go and preach the gospel. And if the wicked turn away from its wickedness and repent and come back, you have saved his soul and you have saved your soul. But if the wicked does not turn and does not come back. His blood is upon his own head, but you have saved your soul. So we are not there in Israel to force people to believe, but it's the God, the Spirit of God will convict the people. And I'm very happy that many Christians, many Jewish people, Messianic Jews, they have believed in Yeshua HaMashiach. And you know, Heaven and hell is real. Jesus Christ, Yeshua HaMashiach, is the God of the heaven and the earth. He alone is coming down to judge the whole world. In the Bible it says, so Jewish people, don't harden your hearts. In the Proverbs 3.12 it says, For whom the Lord loveth, he correcteth, even as a father, the son in whom he delighteth. So, Always you disobeyed God and God has disciplined you by sending you into the four corners of the earth. God has disciplined you by uh, sending you into captivity. But God is more than disciplining. He is a merciful God. He is a merciful God and everlasting Father. When we repent and come back to Him, that God is forgiving. God is very patient with us. God is slow to anger and God is just, righteous, heavenly father, holy, righteous and sovereign God. In Hosea, if you see in book of Hosea, God told prophet Hosea to go and marry a prostitute. Why? Go and marry and bring her home. And why he told that? Because God says, Israel was my, like a wife to me. I was their husband. So dear friends, God is God has chosen you not because you were very good, 
God has chosen you not because you were very good. God says you are the most stubborn and stiff-necked generation. But God says, I will bring you back to this land only for your holy name's sake. Only for, your ho only for my holy name's sake, God said, I will bring you back. And for my faithfulness to Abraham, my promise to Abraham. So dear friends, Tovia Singer, you always say, Muslims are good, Christians are coming and changing people into Christianity. No. Christianity is not a religion by force. God is holy and you worship him with your whole heart, mind and soul. And God says, I am coming again only to judge the whole world. So I pray that you will stop persecuting Christians in your country. I think Israel don't just like the money and don't just like the money and emanations and army of Christian countries. Love Christians because they are believing in your Yeshua, Jewish Messiah, Yeshua HaMashiach and Jesus is God, nothing else. Yeshua HaMashiach is that God, only one God of the heaven and the earth who has done the salvation plan to save the mankind from sin, from eternal death and from Satan the devil. So dear friends, Israel, you think that you are very strong on your own. No. Your strength comes from Yeshua HaMashiach, the God of the heaven and the earth. So believe in Jesus Christ. If you don't believe in us, don't believe. Ask, ask in your own mind. If Jesus Christ, Yeshua HaMashiach, if you are God, reveal yourself to us. And that God of the heaven and the earth, Elohim, Hashem, uh, El Shaddai, Adonai, that God, will reveal himself to you because Jesus Christ only came for the plan of salvation for the sins of the whole world for the Jews and Gentiles so that the gospel will be reached to the ends of the earth and in the end Bible says every knee shall bow and every tongue will confess that Jesus is God of the heaven and the earth so we bless Israel but dear friends Israel, don't think that just because God chose you physically that you have all the right to do anything. No. God, is, God does not favor anybody. For everyone, for God, everyone is equal. Everyone is made by God and everyone is equal. God chose Israel to be a nation of priests, prophets and missionaries. But Israel failed to do that. So dear friends, Israel, God is God of love, ever merciful and forgiving. So repent and accept Jesus Christ as Lord God and Savior because God is coming soon to judge the whole world. And I say to Israel, God makes the nation great and destroys them. And God changes times, seasons, and He removes kings and set up kings. So dear friends, Jesus Christ is that almighty God, everlasting Father and Prince of Peace. If you don't want to believe in me, don't believe, but ask in your own, you know, ask yourself, ask Jesus Christ, Yeshua HaMashiach, if you are God, Reveal yourself to me and he will reveal himself to you. And I bless Israel and I pray that if you are killing any innocent lives, God says, God hates innocent killing. In the Bible it says, in the Bible God said, you know, six things God hates. A lying tongue, hands that shed innocent blood, a heart that plan wicked, feet that run for mischief, a false witness, and he that soweth discord among brethren. So dear friends, God hates innocent killing. So if you are killing unnecessarily, God will judge and discipline 
the Jewish people and those who are killing innocent lives. So dear friends, believe in Yeshua because we are running off time every day and we are living in the end times and it's time to seek and search and come back to God. God says, come back to me. God even said in the Bible, it's better to obey than your vain sacrifices. So it's better to obey God than vain sacrifices. So dear friends, believe in Yeshua HaMashiach, the God of the heaven and earth, who came down only for the plan of salvation, for the sins of the whole world. God bless you all. Amen. Amen.